Hello guys, welcome to Aegis Channel. So today we're gonna make cabbage stew. Okay, so what do we have here? Um, I want mushrooms. Mushroom. There we go. Okay, I know that's why I'm adding it. Sometimes I add mushrooms to my cabbage stew. Abby loves it. Abby, we did corned beef and bacon. Well, no, we corned beef and so so I say. And a cabbage, my brown corn cabbage, into me jam. And I baby some some bell pepper on so. Tomatoes, tomatoes no say. And I can use cabbage in only one. And can use best a half of this, but me use two cab eh, cabbage in you know. Me use cabbage me you know. I love it when I have a lot of tomatoes in there because I also have the bell pepper, so I need more tomatoes. Two onions that I'll be blending one. I'll be blending the smaller one, this one, with the garlic and the peppers. Then I'll slice half of this to begin the stew. And once it's almost done, I'm going to add the other half sliced also. I have carrots. I'm going to chop it into squares or smaller sizes. I have my beef here. I'll chop, season, stew it, and I'll fry it. And I also have this tomato paste here. I love it um, when it's in my cabbage stew to bring out that reddish color. And some seasoning. Lastly, salt. So let's get started. To begin, I'm going to chop the beef that we are going to season for the stew. What? For that, I'm going to do it because I'll be using the adult knife. When it's time for the veggies, Abby can help me with that. So this is the meat, it's rinsed and it's clean. I'm going to chop the onions and put it on it. I'm going to chop just half of the small size onion. I'm adding the onions to the meat. Adding some salt, about half a tablespoon. Okay. You know, add some seasoning. I'm going to add the homemade seasoning that I did with ginger, garlic. Fine, and sometimes we add some other flavors, natural flavors. So these, this have. Have you added? It? Mm -hmm. It's going to melt by itself. So I'm putting it on the stove. I'll cover it and turn it on to medium and I'll come and check on it after about 20 minutes and stir it until all the seasoning are mixed up where everywhere now that we have the, the beef on the stove we are going to chop all the vegetables that we need for the cabbage stew so Abby is going to help
this is the smaller size onion that I'm going to blend. So I chop that into squares to make it easier to blend. I'm adding the four pieces of bell pepper and garlic. I'll add small amount of water so it's easier to blend. Let's check on the meat. I'll just cover it and leave it for just about 30 minutes. I'm going to take it off the stove and I'm going to drain all the stuff from it. Then I'll fry it. So I have my oil is ready, so I'm putting in the beef. We have everything we need. Let's start making the cabbage stew. I'm turning on the stove. I just put my pan on. Once it's a little bit hot, I'm going to put in the oil. Putting in the oil. The way cabbage is, it, it cannot dissolve most of the oil, so you don't need to add a lot of the oil. I'm putting in the onion.
So I just put in the bell peppers and the carrots. I'm going to add the onion that I put aside. I'm going to leave it to simmer a little bit to get the flavors of the bell pepper and the onion in there. Before I put in the last in ingredient, that is the cabbage. Wasabi doesn't want it to be that grow, grow, grow sound like that. Wow, she cabbage for a baby. Wait, any more before. Any byron so be co any broad be co or men can any be co eh come on kasa and now uh cabbage stew is ready it looks perfect just amazing and it tastes good I'm going to turn off the stove and I will let it cool down and store them in my regular bowls put them in the fridge I have my amamu here I'm going to add some of the cabbage steel so I have my rice and I have my cabbage steel I'm so hungry and I'm tired I've been eating since I ate my breakfast in the morning and it's already almost 10 p.m. so I'm going to enjoy it thank you guys for watching we'll see you in our next video please don't forget to subscribe hit the notification that is the bell icon there next to the subscribe button share with all your friends encourage them to also share they should subscribe tell their friends to subscribe help us boost the channel so we will have these amazing videos to help all of us we'll see you in our next video bye